How's it going guys? My name is Skycap and welcome to a brand new video on the channel. Today, welcome to FIFA 17. I know that I am pretty late with this video, but oh well, like a lot of people have made videos about FIFA 17 demo, but I just thought that I could do it as well. And yeah, I'm just going to be basically giving you like a review of the FIFA and also I just wanted to apologize for the quality not being the best. But, um, like, that was the best that I could have done. And also, sorry that I don't have a face cam, but I'm just looking completely trash. Um, and, yeah, and I guess with that being said, let's get started into the actual gameplay. So, the first thing that I wanted to talk about is the defending in this game. Because that was the first thing that actually came in my mind when I was playing the game. Because in FIFA 16, when he made a tackle, the chances were that um, you fouled the opponent. And it was a free kick to them. Whereas, in this FIFA, it is not like like it and um, the players seem to be like much more intelligent and the shooting is also a bit um, like more powerful than it used to be in FIFA 16 which is really good it is way more realistic um, and also the throwing with the keeper um, as you saw right there like the keeper has a much better throwing that it used to have in FIFA 16 so now let's go back to the shooting so in FIFA 16 there was no way that the shooting was as good in the FIFA 17 because in FIFA 17 you can actually feel feel the curve on the ball whereas in FIFA 16 it, it was it was really like on me and the ball movement of the ball was just atrocious and um, yeah the long shots in FIFA 17 are also much much better uh, which I really personally do like about it um, I think some people won't really like it but in my opinion those things are really good now let's move on to heading and just basically headers in general in fifa 16 the headers were, weren't that overpowered whereas in the demo version of fifa 17 i found them a bit overpowered because like about i don't know um six out of eight goals that i've actually scored were headers like i don't know if it's just my style of play but the headers were absolutely overpowered but they were also like really accurate and um yeah like they really were really realistic as well and as you can see on the screen right now that animations are absolutely amazing they're so smooth and just so much detailed and it is so much better than fifa 16's one now i just want to show you like a really really quick clip of a free kick and as you can see here it detected automatically if like the distance is safe to shoot or not and it actually like done the thingy majiggy where you pass it and like that is really really different and also the shot were amazing and as you can see right there the goal was from heading like what a surprise so as we are talking about free kicks, let's just quickly talk about corner kicks. So this is one of the things that has changed significantly because you don't have this like animation and now it is just purely like a, you have got like, you have more control of where the ball will be going and to who. Uh, and yeah, the free kicks, in my opinion, um, I think I just have to get used to them, but I don't really like them. And I also don't really like penalties, just as I will show you about in a second. Um, but but yeah, um, the thing that I also found really good is passing. As you saw right there, the passing over the top was absolutely amazing. It was so accurate. Um, and yeah, it was just really... I, 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 like, I actually felt the game, not like FIFA 16. In FIFA 16, I felt like I'm playing with robots. But in this FIFA, it is totally different. Um, and yeah, I'm now just like... We've got another corner right there. Yeah, as you can see, you've got this scroll wheel right there. It is pretty hard to control this scroll wheel. I'm not going to lie about that but um yeah you have to sometimes just watch out so that the keeper doesn't actually get the ball and i think that this will actually help it because um you know you just know where you can basically um cross the ball in and another corner kick right there um it, it, and as i said it is really hard to control the stick I, I don't know why but it's just hard to control it um but yeah now i think we should get on to the penalties so yeah, let's do this Boom. So penalties, another thing that has significantly changed. And uh, like, to be honest, I don't really like them. As you can see right there, the per shot was pretty perfect. But then I, I, it's just one touch on your corner or a penalty, sorry, is like absolutely terrible. It really, I, I, I absolutely hate those penalties. Um, I think I will get used to them. But like, for now, I honestly do hate those. It is really, really hard to actually take the penalties. But actually, when you actually shoot, I really like 
like the goalkeeper animations and the ball animations or you know all the new things and you can do it is also pretty easy to actually save the ball with the keeper much better than it used to be but as you can see there I just cannot score a goal I scored one but that was literally it um, because I don't know but I, I don't know but I'm, I'm not really too confident in those penalties I am sure that some people absolutely love it some people will I uh, just like me absolutely hate it but yeah the penalties like you need to actually be you need to take a lot of penalties so that you can get used to those um and um yeah i think i'm just gonna leave you with those on and um yeah i guess this will be it for this video my name is good hope you have an amazing day and peace out hope you guys enjoy those pens bye